In this video, we'll show you how to scrape Chewy.com, the American online pet, food, supply, and toy retailer. Chewy was founded in 2011 and has generated $2 billion, which is 51% of all online pet food sales by 2017. Chewy was acquired in the same year by PetSmart for over $3 billion, the largest e-commerce purchase at the time. The company has generated over $9 billion in 2021 and has over 21,000 employees. As an e-commerce company, there are no physical stores but Chewy has 13 fulfillment centers where it ships products from. Chewy hosts over 3,000 brands of pet foods and items and has 24-7 customer service available to assist customers. Are you ready to scrape dog, cat, fish, bird, reptile, farm, horse, and other pet products? Let's begin. Step 1. Scraping products Firstly, open Parsub and log in. Click New Project to start a new project. Enter the Chewy.com URL you wish to scrape. We will be scraping dog plush toys with this URL. Once the page Page loads, click Ctrl or Command 1 a few times with your cursor on the first product's name until an A tag appears. Then click to extract the product. Redo this for the next product's name to train the algorithm. You may need to scroll down to the other product section and click there too to extract every product on the first page. Rename the selection on the left to Product. Step 2. Scraping Prices and Reviews Now that we have our products, we can use Parcel's Relative Select tool to scrape relative data for each product. Begin by clicking the plus button and next to your product selection. Choose relative select and click the first product's name, then its price. Scroll down to the next product section and redo the product click, then the price. Rename the selection on the left to price. You can redo these steps for other details such as product reviews or ratings. Note, if there's extra text that shows up in the price, you can add regular expressions which will only show the price. Step 3. Pagination To scrape multiple pages, begin by scrolling down the page until you see the nav bar. Click the plus button next to your page selection and choose select. Click the next page button to extract it. Rename the selection on the left to pagination. Expand the selection and delete the two extractions. Click the plus button next to your pagination selection and choose click. Click yes and enter the additional amount of pages you wish to scrape. Entering zero will scrape every single page. Step 4. Bypassing blocks. At the time of this guide, it seems like IP rotation is required to scrape Chewy.com. Without it, you may run into blocks resulting resulting into an empty data file. To enable IP rotation, click the settings cog on the top left of parcel and then click the settings tab. Finally, tick the rotate IP addresses box. Note, this is a paid parcel feature. Step 5. Start scraping. Now that you have set up your parcel project to extract products, their prices and other details such as reviews, and have set up pagination and IP rotation, it is time to begin scraping. Click the green get data button on the left and choose whether you want to test, run or schedule your scrape. We chose to run the scrape a single time and here's what our data export look like. Running into scraping issues, you can contact our live chat support. The link is in the description below. Happy scraping!